The Strait of Gibraltar is located between Spain in the south and Morocco in the north and connects the waters of the Mediterranean Sea with the waters of the Atlantic Ocean. Its ancient Arabic name is Bahar al Zakak and Bahar al Majaz. The western entrance to the strait is bounded by Cape Spartel, Morocco, and Cape Trafalgar, Spain. The strait is supervised by Morocco, Spain, and British Autonomous region of Gibraltar. The name goes back to the commander Tariq ibn Ziyad who crossed it at the beginning of the Islamic conquest of Spain in 711 AD and the wording of the name has been transcribed in European languages where it is called Gabrieltar in English or Khabaraltar in Spanish. Its water depth is about 300 meters and the shortest distance between its banks is 14 kilometers. It is considered one of the most important sea crossings in the world. It was called the Pillars of Hercules, as it is said that the mythical continent of Atlantis was located behind it. The Strait of Gibraltar is a narrow strait that connects the Atlantic Ocean with the Mediterranean Sea and separates Europe on the one hand Spain from Africa on the one side of Morocco. It is an autonomous region belonging to Britain and a very important navigational route, which is major crossing for ships coming from and to the Mediterranean Sea towards the Atlantic Ocean, and Spain tried to claim it to return it to its sovereignty, but it failed in this endeavor. Today, it is tourist destination for visitors to enjoy everything, ranging from priceless archaeological treasures to a wide range of shops and restaurants. Despite its small area, estimated at about six square kilometers, it is rich in culture and history, especially the well-known rock, beaches, and marine activities. It's magical to take a trip up the famous rock in Gibraltar, where you can see the Spanish and Moroccan coasts. There you will find amazing tunnels that chronicle the human ability. They were dug in the rock to protect the area from the siege that might inflict open to. They were dug underground for mostly military purposes. There you will find the fortress of the king, which was the cornerstone of defense during the many wars that the region went through. The fort was turned into a recreational center for young people and old original walls and theaters were preserved. The magic of Gibraltar cuisine brings you back to the long relationship between the Spaniards, the British and the Andalusians, as well as the Forginers who made Gibraltar their home over the past three centuries. There you enjoy meals from Maltese cuisine, Genoese cuisine, Portugal, Andalusia and Britain. One of the most famous dishes is rosto, which is pasta with pieces of meat, tomatoes, mushrooms, and carrots. In addition to the fact that most dishes contain olive oil, vegetables, meat, and fish, maritime cities are distinguished by their lighthouses, but the Gibraltar lighthouse makes you overlook the European and African continents and is located at an altitude of 49 meters above sea level and over a distance of 37 kilometers, but it is now operating in an automatic way. The area is also distinguished by its gallery built by the British, which is one of the the most important tourist attractions and displays graffiti dating back to 17 and 26 AD. Wikitube, the first audiovisual encyclopedia in the English version.